Donald Trump has once again responded to his legal problems by attacking those who would prosecute him. But this time, that poses a new and greater danger, a Washington Post analysis suggests today. Trump's preemptive announcement that he would be indicted for his role in 2016 hush money payments to adult film actress Stormy Daniels enabled him to make himself the center of attention of both the legal and political worlds, offering a window into his campaign strategy while highlighting the dangers he poses to the stability of the country. The Post reported. In typical fashion, Trump didn't wait for the grand jury to speak, calling on his followers to stage protests in an echo of what he had tweeted ahead of the January 6, 2021, attack on the U.S. Capitol, be there. Will be wild, the Post noted. On Friday morning, the former president posted an even more troubling message on True Social, calling Bragg a degenerate psychopath and warning of potential death and destruction if he is indicted in connection with what he termed a false charge. But after what happened on January 6, 2021, everything is different, the analysis suggested. In the past, statements like that were not taken seriously enough. But after his lies about the 2020 election, the storming of the U.S. Capitol and everything else he has done to undermine the integrity of the voting process, that's no longer possible. No one today discounts the possibility of violence surrounding the former president, or instigated by him. His call for protests prompted law enforcement officials in New York to erect security barriers around the criminal court complex. His declarations on Friday led House Minority Leader Hakeem Jeffries, Democrat in New York, to warn that Trump's reckless, reprehensible and irresponsible rhetoric could get someone killed. Don't expect Trump's approach to change soon, according to the Post analysis. A Republican who supports him said that, under these circumstances, there is only one political strategy for Trump, attack, attack, attack. The former president will continue to try to turn every legal investigation into a political fight, as he has done since he became president. He will play victim and demand that his party defend him against the Democrats, the legal system, the left, and the media.